When you're a student, especially a student who either openly or not openly is struggling with your sexuality or gender expression identity or trying to navigate being bullied and policed because of these things, what a teacher says has such importance and how a teacher chooses to respond. So by not responding, you're saying something as well. Absolutely. So my name is uh, Michael Salvatore. I'm the uh, CEO and Registrar at the Ontario College of Teachers. So my name is Kim Snyder uh, and I use she, her pronouns and I'm a teacher at Rosedale Heights School of the Arts and I teach drama, English and grade 11 gender studies. My name is Adam Davies. I'm a PhD candidate at the Ontario Institute for Studies and Education. I am an educator and an educational researcher. In my research um, looks at men the mental health of LGBTQ2S plus individuals. Um, to keep students um, at, the, at the forefront of our teaching, to remember that we teach students, we don't teach subjects uh, as important as they all are to us in the various disciplines, um, but we meet the learners where they are and we need to be uh, aware of what matters to them, what um, may be an impediment or an obstacle um, to their learning and it may be uh, a life struggle that they're having that has something to do uh, with their gender, with their gender identity or with um, uh, their sexual orientation. So I think uh, teachers need to be mindful um, of that and keep students at the, at the forefront. Two Spirit, a spiritual identity for some Indigenous people. This term implies the embodiment of both masculine and feminine spiritual qualities within the same body and has different meanings for different Indigenous communities. Some Indigenous people use this term to have gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender, etc. LGBTQ, an initialism for lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, queer, two-spirit, sexual and gender minorities for a synonymous term. Cisgender is a person whose gender identity and sex assigned at birth are congruent. A GSA, or a Gay Straight Alliance, or a Gender Sexuality Alliance, is a student organization founded in many K-12 schools that create safe and supportive places for LGBTQ2 students and their allies. Questioning. A term used to describe those who are in a process of discovery and exploration about their sexual orientation, gender identity, gender expression, or a combination thereof. To be gender diverse, gender non-conforming, or non-binary, that's a person whose gender identity and or gender expression do not conform to the norms and stereotypes society expects of their assigned sex. Youth may identify as neither or both genders. Homo negativity negative attitudes towards lesbian, gay, and bisexual people and relationships. Misgendering. Attributing a gender to someone that is incorrect slash does not align with their gender identity. It can occur when using pronouns, gendered language like, hello ladies, hey guys, or assigning genders to people without knowing how they identify. Well, since we're all women in this room, we understand, blah blah blah. LGBTQ2 plus adds a plus sign to represent other constellations of identities such as asexual, pansexual, questioning, etc. I think a challenge is how do we how do we go from making LGBTQ education um, an exception, um, something that some teachers are doing and some aren't, and make it widespread. That's the challenge going forward. Is like how do we get all teachers doing this? Uh, because that's how we'll create a, a much bigger climate of inclusivity in our schools.